Hello again, everyone. We are Gaming by Gaslight, and welcome back to another episode of RimWorld. When we last left off, we went off on a probably poorly uh, conceived mission thing. And, uh, you know, here we are. I mean, poor Troy is all alone in the vault by himself. Uh, he seems to be hanging on there, though. No, he is hungry. Well, he's not hungry anymore, I guess. Oh, what, what's going on over here? The vault, the main door is potentially about to break. Because he, he doesn't, he's not a maintenance man. He's a other type of man. And the peace talks were successful. Okay, they are still hostile, but they are less hostile than they were previously. So that kind of works out. Uh, you know what? Let's, let's set up a camp here as well. I wasn't planning on it, but I am thinking maybe. All right, let's uh, let's do some harvesting. I don't think I'm gonna waste time with uh, mining or anything like that. And if there's any non-exploding wildlife, yeah, we'll uh. Getting a, a bit of a feeling here. Okay. We are going to be stuck sleeping on the floor. There we are. Nice little medical bed for... for Larson there. Uh, we should probably... endeavor to chop down some trees. There we are. Maybe, maybe a few more if uh, the opportunity presents itself. And what we want to do, the butcher table, because the butcher table is more effective. And I think we'll just build a campfire for simple meals. Makes the most sense as far as I'm concerned. And the butcher table, because again, we want... Uh... You botched the job. How? How could you do such a fail at such a simple task? I mean, we're not going to take the butcher table home with us, but everything else. Also, uh, let's let's get these corpses, shall we? You know what? You can bring whatever corpse. Oh, look at the little guinea pig. All right, cook all the simple meals you can, and if you can't, then do that. There we go. And as for you, you butcher, you butcher creatures, you do that forever. Did I, did I actually succeed in my task? I did, in fact, set it to do forever. All right, so we might, we might be okay here. And you know what, if there's time, we'll, we'll mine some more components. Because you can never have too many components. I want to blow up the boom lope as well. Maybe grab some heal root. For healing purposes, obviously. I mean, I might as well... Because people are going to be standing around doing nothing. I suspect. For a lot of the time. Alright. Hops are going to the stockpile. I can't actually do anything with hops yet, can I? No, I haven't done the research. You know, I actually might make this a top priority for Troy. That way, you know, at least we make... Really? You're gonna clean dirt outside? I know, there's mods to resolve that sort of thing. We have food sitting in here? We have the horseshoe pin. Let's go ahead and install that just so that people don't go to their mines with... Uh... Oh, they really enjoyed their stay and left me a bunch of unfertilized goose eggs. How kind. Still don't have any bathrooms. Oh, a mad lynx! Okay. There we go. Are, are we actually cooking meals, by the way? Some meals have been made. And we do have wood to actually do stuff here. You know what? Might as well... Uh 
build a latrine. Oh wait, here's a fountain. I was talking about... Oh hey, there's no water fountains, but... When did, was I talking about that? It was an episode or so ago, I think. Pretty sure I made a thing about fountains. Didn't I? I think I did. I'll say I did. And yeah, if anyone's got to go to the latrine, we'll just kind of tuck it over here in the corner. Because I think... Yeah, I put a... Put a steel basin here. I mean, you can get water from it, but... Uh, yeah, I'd rather have... Right? I can't just stick a fountain on top of that, unfortunately. You know what? I'll leave that as a sink. I feel it, uh, I feel it fits better. Oh man, look at all that. All right, let's build a coffee. And also make lots of food. Ten meals, I mean, that's probably more than sufficient, but, uh... Alright. Time to get up, everybody. Jay, you lazy bum. Get that installed. Alrighty then. There we go. Alright, so now we've got everything we need for an appropriate uh, getting stuff done type operation. You have other people who can cook, right? Yeah, Jay can cook, but Jay is not cooking. Jay, please cook. Elliot is... Why, what was your problem now, Elliot? That's getting up there. You ate raw food. You didn't have to eat raw food. You chose to eat raw food. You are... These other things I can kind of understand. Elliot, you fool! No! Don't binge on the food. Uh, where did... Okay, Grant, when you're done with that, let's get back to cooking, shall we? Got a lot of meals to prepare. Well, actually, you know what? It shouldn't take that long, come to think of it. Elliot is being problematic, I have to say. Just a little bit. Eating all the food, but, uh... Actually, you know what? You know what we can do to stop that? Let's, uh... Load... Yeah, load all the simple meals. There you go. We'll hide. Hide the food. There we go. That gets the job done. Okay, let's get the heck out of here. Where are you going? That's... that is... unnecessary. Reform caravan. Bring additional food. Leave the mega sloth meat. We'll take all of this, because why the heck not? Uh, the wood... tempting. I'll leave the butcher table, because it's pretty darn heavy. Then again, it won't... It actually won't slow us down... that much. Hmm. You know what? Yeah, we'll, we'll take this instead. We don't need another butcher table. It'll take us two days, we have enough food to get there, it'll be fine. Jolly good. See how things work out, and now Troy is getting lots of good work done. Uh, when you're done researching, do you mind, uh... Fixing some of these things that are potentially going to blow up soon? That would be nice. Oh geez, definitely. <laughs> definitely- oh god. Yeah, make sure we're maintaining, like, we don't want our react- Will this actually go- like, critical, if it fails. Oh my. Oh my god, it's... There's so many rats. But they only attack people, so my animals will be fine. They've all got Scaria. Which... Is that a, is that a real disease, or is that like a, a fancy space disease based off of rabies? You know what? Let's find that out now. Let's look up the word. What is Scaria? Or Scaria? I'm gonna say Scaria, because Scaria sounds a little too on the nose. 
Uh, it's a rim. Yeah, it's a it's a rim world disease. I don't. Oh wait, wait, wait. Vinod Scaria isn't. Oh no, that's a Indian researcher pioneering in precision medicine and clinical genomics in India. Uh, it's a surname. It is derived from the Hebrew name or given name Zachariah, which means, if we look at this, uh, God has remembered. Okay. Um, Ah, here we are. Scaria disease. Is it a, it is not a real disease as far as I can tell. Maybe it's named after Vinod Scaria, a, you know, Indian uh, geneticist, medical doctor guy person. As far as I can tell, though, it's not a real disease. Okay, that's all I wanted to know. Picked up a few, uh, you know what, I should do this more often. If I have a question, I should just Google it mid-video. Because then at least, if nothing else, it potentially adds some interesting topics of conversation. Should probably tell him to not go outside. Then again... He's kind of doing that all on his own, isn't he? I mean, he has no real reason to go outside except to... ...harvest the hop plants, so with that in mind, let's, uh... Under nope, not schedule. No, it is under schedule. So we'll we'll limit you to only indoors. And while we're at it, let's. Uh, what counts as indoors? That's technically not indoors. And by technically, I mean it is, literally not indoors. I can also tell from context that. Uh, I intend for this to not technically count as indoors, but this is indoors, so if we want people indoors, this can count for the purposes of being inside. Uh, group- oh no. Oh no! You guys have guns? You have a club? Oh no! My Hiver friends, and they're coming to visit! Oh dear. But, the rats, you don't realize the situation. There's so many rats. Oh, Elliot's no longer picking out on food. That's good to know. God, that, their screeching is so annoying. Oh God, here they come. All right, guys. You know, I wish the AI was a little smarter about this. Like, surely you'd figure they'd be like, oh, hey, there's a bunch of manhunting rats. We'll just ignore them and keep walking. No, they're... It's only when they're actually getting attacked. Like, they're not even stopping to help their fellows. Stupid AI. They're, okay. No, no, yeah. They're, they're not helping each other. It's just... Well... Like, how bad is the situation? It's pretty bad. Uh, I, I would like to point out, though, this is not my fault. It's the AI's fault for them being stupid and not recognizing the danger and, like, stopping to team up and do something about it. I, I take no responsibility for what is transpiring here. You know, let's just make our lives easier. Where's, where's the allow tool? God, the noise of these things. Faction? Oh, you're angry. Hey. Don't get mad at me, get mad at your stupid friends. They're mad at me for recruiting. There's no recruiting happening here. Wait, Reuben is set to rescue Ann Hall. So, would Re will Reuben rescue these people? I mean, it, it's not looking good. Oh, you've got a hydraulic jaw. But yeah, they're they're all dead. Oh boy, this is gonna this is gonna anger the hive. I don't think the Western Hive is gonna be happy with me. Huh, he does prioritize hauling corpses though. Okay, we've got still about another day. Plenty of food. I forget if this is a disease that eventually wears itself out, though. 
Might be. Because I know, of course, uh, Vanilla Room World. Oh god, what, what's happening? They briefly started attacking. Some, oh god, my air conditioning units. But yeah, so uh, what, what did Scaria say again? Chance of rotting upon death so they cannot be butchered. Okay, yeah. But I read the... I don't know why, but even though I've read this several times now, I, I briefly read the notion that they were going to um, a raid caravan. Oh no, it's a caravan we can raid. Okay. Well, it's all the way over there. Why is it stopping here for 23 days? That's just suspicious. Also, why am I not getting alerts about these research requests? I feel like that didn't pop up. Not even here. So what, what, what's the deal here, game? Why aren't you telling me about these things? Research request would be pretty cool and would make the, uh, the Western Hive happier with us. Oh god, we've got a rat inside the walls of... I was gonna say, I, should, I can just have Troy shoot, but he has no guns. Ha! Ah, it can't do anything against my powerful vault door. God, there's so many corpses lying around here. And I couldn't save any of them. Because Troy doesn't have any weapons. Man, who'd have thought a bunch of psychotic rats would be so deadly? Though... Oh no, you're not starving. You died. I mean... Well, yeah, we can't really see what their stats are. We can't get an idea if they're starving or not, which I assume they're not because there's all kinds of stuff. I think they might even be eating my hay. Yet another reason why we need to start building stuff here. Which actually would be an argument for why I should have been prioritizing harvesting steel. Speaking of, let's uh, get rid of all this steel over here. Yeah. Because if we're going to build walls, we, we do want to try building these super durable walls right here. Discourage the AI from tunneling through. Alright. How much steel is this going to cost me? That's a lot of steel. But you do get a fair amount of steel, to be honest. Oh boy. I got us to stop for a second. Yeah, we could just build, uh, dirt road. Oh, there we go. Oh, wait, no, 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 this does require wood. Oh, but we have wood, I think. You know what, we won't, we won't worry about that sort of thing. Let's just go back to Vault 2020 and... We'll, we'll start building roads, I don't know, once we actually start recruiting people and have like a big workforce of people who are just sitting around doing nothing. Oh. The rats are still crazy, but... They're slightly less crazy than they were before and, and honestly, Ruben here is doing a reasonably good job of hauling stuff inside. Troy is also... Oh, Troy, could you, uh, repair that electric smelter? Anything else that's on the verge of maybe blowing up? I'm actually kind of surprised, uh, someone with only an intellectual of two, you have made pretty good progress on our vault neutrifier, neutrifier, whatever you want to call it. I'm proud of you, Troy. Gonna... Raise the priority of these back up. Oh, what's going on here? A caravan meeting, you say? Well... 
Is there anything I actually want from you? Answer is not really. Well, I mean, we could buy some more pemmican. Which, uh, you know, not, not strictly, ah, what the heck, that's a lot of pemmican. <laughs> How much for 150? Sell you a little bit of gold to make up the balance. Do I actually have 240 gold? Wow, I didn't think I had brought back that much. Alright, well, you know what, let's, uh, maybe we'll, uh, You know what? That's, that's good enough for me. We're still bringing a fair amount of gold home. Then we'll move on. Oh, and we're almost home. <laughs> there is a... What? Caravan divan? Jeez, we're... They want Grant's jumpsuit. Uh, and there's two of them. There's two settlers. Well, son, you just... <laughs> really? Really? Your name's Loser? You're a gourmand, a slowpoke, but you are tough. You're a quick sleeper and an ascetic, so you prefer having a... a, a less exciting room. That's a bit of an interesting one. Capable- and you're only 18 years old. That's an interesting story. You got a 51-year-old woman and an 18-year-old man. Kind of, uh, in tr But then again, you know, that's the- that's the thing about RimWorld, isn't it? It's all about them, their stories. Oh wait, yeah. I want you guys to be... recruited. And, uh... We'll just make a line in the shallows and we'll... Tell our animals to make sure that they're out of the line of fire, because that's just smart. I like this river. What a nice, uh, nice scene here we've got. Oh! Cougar, less good. Oh, wow, and we, we just straight up shot him dead. Well, Surrey, that's, uh... Ah, oh, geez, and it pushed us an entire tile back. I hate that. I hate that so much. Oh, well, it's part of life. Bunch of dead man's clothes, a little bit of extra silver. And I don't really care for anything else, so we'll just move on for our Oh! Oh no, look at that! We actually did stay where we, we were. You know what? I like that. Is that an update? Is that something that changed? Because I'm pretty sure it used to be if you... Maybe I'm just crazy, I don't know. Whoa, 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 slow your roll, fellas. So why'd you just drop all this steel here? That's, uh... Alright, you guys will take care of stuff. Someone rescue Elliot. Uh, Nielsen, if you can, I would like you to prioritize... Where the hell did all this steel come from? There's a lot of steel just lying around. What the heck? Has this been here this whole time? Damn, that's a lot of steel. You know what? You know what? I'm willing to bet. I probably, if I looked at the scenario settings, I'd probably originally, before like deciding, ah, screw it, I'll just, you know, dev mode build. Uh, our starting place before starting the scenario, I probably thought, oh, hey, you know, I'll, I'll give the starting call on us because it's probably close to where... No, drop down's usually at the middle of the map, so we would have dropped here. Maybe I just started the scenario... Where the hell did <laughs> all that steel come from? Wait, is someone getting attacked? Oh. Our horses are being attacked. You bastard. Alright, well, that's, uh... That's life, I guess. And there's all the sleeping rats. 
gonna be problematic, I can tell you. Alright, you can drop your wood right there. That's close enough to home. I'll wait for someone to unload this. Just because I don't want it to rot. Someone will repair these. You know what? This is this has been overall pretty effective. And it is time to say goodbye. So until the next time, as always, thank you all for watching. I hope y'all enjoyed. Don't forget to hit that like button or maybe leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you're thinking and I will see all you in the next video.